Hey there, Michael James. Welcome to my space here. Today I'm working on this mix by a band called Valentino is Dead, and I want to try out a few different compressors and A-B them. And rather than using the patch bay over there with all those wires and assistance and mayhem, um, we are going to just use a dangerous liaison right here because it is uh, a six loop switcher um, that allows me to try different combinations of outboard gear in different uh, signal paths, signal flows. It's, it's really just a cool piece. So we're listening to a vocal right here. This is, by the way, real time in progress. I'm mixing this tune right now. Uh, so check this out. Listen to the vocal here. I'm a train wreck. I'm derailed. There's devastation in my wake. All right. What I can do is real quickly try a FET compressor. So check this out. I'm a train wreck. I'm a train wreck. I'm a train wreck. I'm a train wreck. Hitting the 1176 pretty hard. Let's hear what happens if we use LA3A. I just switched them, by the way. I'm a train wreck. I'm a train wreck. Now I'm going to tighten up this loop really tight. And uh, each time I'll switch back and forth between 1176 and LA3A, starting with 1176. I'm a train wreck. 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 Well, that's going by pretty quickly. Um, so maybe that wasn't such a good idea to try that. But you get the idea of what I'm doing here. Um, so I like both of them. So I'm going to put the uh, 1176 in front of the LA3A. And this is what that sounds like. I'm a train wreck. I'm a train wreck. And um, if I can, if I want to change the order of that, I just press this flip button. Boom, now we have uh, Opto in front of FET. I'm a train wreck. I'm a train wreck. Go back the other way. I'm a train wreck. That, that's I'm pretty, it's pretty amazing that you can do that so quickly. Um, you know, let's try the LA3A or the Opto in parallel, okay? So here's just the dry thing. I'm a train wreck. I'm a train wreck. I'm blending in LA3A. I'm a train wreck. I'm a train wreck. That's parallel as opposed to series. I'm a train wreck. You really hear it clamping down in series. I'm a train wreck. Parallel. I'm a train wreck. Two blended together. So really cool blend knob here. This parallel blend knob um, is great. A lot of people think it's a wet dry fader. Um, it's, it's not that, it's like a fader on your console. Um, so you just kind of bring it up to where it sounds good from, from minus infinity up to unity gain. I'm a train wreck. I'm a train wreck. I'm a, I'm a train wreck. I like it right about there. So um, I'm gonna leave that. Let's find out what it sounds like to bring the 1176 back in um, on the insert or in series. I'm a train wreck. I like that. And let's find out what happens if we uh, make that go away. I'm a train wreck. Now I'll put it back. I'm a train wreck. Yeah, I like that. So um, conversely, we can do that to the entire mix bus. Um, here's everything together. I'm a train wreck. I'm derailed. This devastation in my way. All right, I'm going to add dangerous compressor because it's always the last thing on my mix bus. Before I hit the converters, I can get really good gain. Uh, it's transparent, doesn't, doesn't distort. Here we go. I'm a train wreck. I'm derailed. Okay, that's subtle. Let's say that we want to try a Poltec after it. Just press the button on loop six. Now we got Poltec. I'm a train wreck. Derailed. I like that. I like the added brightness. Let's find out what happens if we put the Poltec in front of the dangerous compressor. All we have to do is press this flip button. Boom. I'm a train wreck. I'm derailed. I don't like what it's doing at the beginning of the words. It's pumping a little hard, so let's unflip it. Remember, all of these, this would be multiple patch changes here. I'm a train wreck. I'm derailed. 
I like that a lot. Let's add some effects to that vocal. I will confess that I set these up before we started filming here. But here we go anyway. I'm a train wreck. I'm derailed. This devastation in my wake. Okay, I like that. Because we have six loops here, of course, I filled them all with outboard gear. Um, let's try adding a variable mu compressor and getting a little tube warmth here. I'm a train wreck. I'm derailed. This devastation in my... And what the hell, just because we can, how about a Tone Lux compressor set to 20 to 1 limiting? Um, let's go ahead and put that before the variable mu and just find out what happens. I'm a train wreck. I'm derailed. That's pumping a little weird for my taste, so let's put it after. And notice we're not going over to the patch bay. We're going right here to liaison, pushing a button, flip. And now our limiter, our hardware limiter, is after the variable mu compressor and before the dangerous compressor and before the pull tech. I'm a train wreck. I'm derailed. This devastation in my way. I like that a lot. Let's make all our vocal processing go away temporarily with the scratch pad here. I'm a train wreck. I'm derailed. And let's put it back in. I'm a train wreck. I'm derailed. Okay, so we've been doing this for what, maybe seven or eight minutes or something like that. Check this out. If I make all that stuff go away that we just did in a matter of minutes, here's where we started when the video started. Now, I'll start with that and I'll bring in everything that we just did while watching this video. Slower than it would have been in real life because in real life I wouldn't be talking about it. Check it out. I'm a train wreck. I'm derailed. This devastation in my wake. Dangerous Liaison, really good uh, patch bay switcher, virtual assistant, faster than switching even plugins. I love it, that's why it occupies prime real estate on my console. Michael James, catch you next time. I'm a train wreck, I'm derailed, this devastating